these out. If you have parallettes, if you can do these from different barbells, um, rig setups, that would be great. Dip setups. We don't have the dip setup here, so we'll be using the garage most often. But if you have that kind of T-bar crazy dip setup in your rig, use that as well. We're gonna just do a dip support. So dip support, guys, can you hold yourself on the ring? You know, we want muscle ups, we want ring dips, we want things like that. But it starts with being able to support your body weight, okay? See the bench here, we need some help, right? But to get into it first, all we're gonna do, again, make sure we're stacked up. Grab the rings nice and tight, shoulders back and down, just like our other support drills, check those out if you haven't, and feet up, stable, 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 okay? If we don't have that right away, we can bring the bench in. Much rather they like using the bench opposed to getting a bunch of bands on the rings. But again, we can start with one foot on. There we are, nice and stable. Then slide the feet off. Again, you notice, we can also get into other positions to work the abdominals and work more trunk stability. So. From here, guys, knees down, we can go knees up, L and point, higher, 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 bring that in. Hope this helps, guys, be able to support, maintain that stability in that position. It's going to give us a lot of functionality, whether we're going overhead, whether we're doing pull-ups, whatever it takes. Guys, get on your ring supports, get your dip support before you try doing 100 dips. Thanks a lot.